Thank you for stopping by. And we start today with a welcome homecoming. China's piano prince Li Yundi has returned to his hometown of Chongqing in southwest China and to launch his national tour. And our reporter Song Yao Tian had a front row seat at the concert and has this report. Renowned pianist Li Yundi is famous for winning the top prize at the International Chopin Competition at the age of just 18. As the youngest ever winner of the prize, people had high hopes for him, and 13 years later, he hasn't disappointed. Now at age of 31, he's showcasing to his fellow Chongqingers that it has grown from that young prodigy to a mature maestro. The concert begins with two of Chopin's nocturnes, number one in B flat manner and number two in E flat, for which he's most famous for. He has even been hailed by the Polish government as the best interpreter in the world of the composer's work. He continued to demonstrate his goals for far more than Chopin, playing Beethoven's sonata Appassionata. He dealt with the emotion and power of the tunes in a great way. He is really different from the rest of the piano concert I've been to because he's so deeply immersed in the music. He's a real piano prince. Mm -hmm. Li's national tour is entitled Piano Dream, with a tight schedule taking him to 30 cities over the next 80 days. He aims to bring his music to many second and third tier cities. It's the first time for me to tour 30 cities in my country. That's very ambitious. Yes, and uh, it's also a big challenge to see that a lot of young people start to uh, know classical music, start to uh, listen uh, piano. Uh -huh. And for me, and it's very important to uh, just to uh, go around the, all the country cities, there are still a lot of cities I have never been. It's the first time. And also appreciate China developed since the uh, last 10 years uh, very quick. And every city has a great uh, music hall and professional. And it's a uh, time, I think, to perform there. After the concert, local fans scrambled to meet the star and get his autograph. It's estimated that there are currently 50 million children learning to play the piano in China, and children were a prominent presence in the audience here. I've brought my daughter here in the hope that I can ignite her interest towards music. My generation didn't have opportunities to listen to music like this. As well as his concert, Li visited a local youth club and his first piano teacher. And as an ambassador of the Chongqing Youth Volunteer Association, he also spoke with children who are currently learning the piano, perhaps inspiring the next big thing in the music world. Song Yaotian, CCTV.